If you're watching this video, then that means you want to know the ins and outs of your roof system. Well, stick around because today we're going to cover the anatomy of a roof system, starting from the very first component installed to the last. Number one, decking. Your decking, also called your sheathing, are wooden planks or sheets that are nailed onto your rafters to attach. They serve as the foundation for the rest of the roof system. Number two, drip edge. Drip edge is a metal flashing like material that is installed on the edge of your roof system and it's to keep water from wicking back and getting your decking wet. Three, ice and water shield. Ice and water shield is a waterproof membrane that's installed on low slope surfaces, in your valleys, and depending on where you are and if you're getting any upgrades for your roof, it could be along the edge of your roof. Four, starter shingles. Starter shingles are a material that are attached to your underlayment and the first course of shingles will actually attach to those starter shingles and it gives your shingle some extra protection against wind. Five, your roof material of choice. This is the part that everybody sees most of and everybody knows. Mostly it's shingles, but sometimes it could be metal, it could be slate, or it could even be wood. Six, flashing. Flashing comes in three main types and it's made out of three main metals. There's counter flashing, step flashing, and apron flashing, and it's made out of aluminum, steel, or copper. It's installed around cracks in your roof system and it protects water from leaking into your roof. Seven, ridge capping. Ridge capping is a material that's installed at the hip of your roof where all roofs meet. Some contractors will try to use three tab shingles for this, but it should be its own material. Eight, roof vents. Finally, roof vents, which come in many different varieties, are installed in your roof system to keep it well ventilated and not shorten its lifespan. So there you go, that's the basic anatomy of a roof system. And if you want to know a little bit more and some upgrades that you can get for your roof system, then you can click on the link below or at the end of this video, and it'll take you to our video of four upgrades you can get for your roof system. I'm Brandon Hayfley, and thank you so much for watching The Roofing Channel. If you enjoyed this video, then like and subscribe, and you can even leave a comment down below. It helps a small channel like us to grow so we can spread more helpful information to homeowners like yourself. I'll see you on the next one.